Alrighty guys, so we're gonna take out the, this is the Dark Horse Thunderstroke, oh, what is it, the 111? I thought it was 116, let me see. Is it 116? This is a 116. Why does it say 111 on there? Yeah, so this is a Thunderstroke 116, as you can see. Really nice. Nice size bags. Man, that's some big bags. Shoot. Could fit, could fit your mama in there. Whew. So this one has some taller bars. Uh, start it here. They always have nice Indian logo. Start her up. She is in neutral. And this is an unassisted ride. So we're just gonna kind of take off on our own here. Alright, she's got a nice nice idle. Let's turn off the radio here. Let's turn that off. Alright, so we'll go to GPS or whatever it is. Into first. Now this has some all the bars so you're just gonna wait so this has some taller bars so we just have to kind of adjust to that you still get the powered windshield what am I in standard all right for this portion we'll go to sport Unassisted. Interesting. You guys remember when I used to do that with the Harleys? <laughs> oh man, unassisted. Pretty familiar with the route. Um, we're gonna take a route 116. So this is gonna be different, man. I mean, I'm pretty used to, not used to, but I've felt and experienced the 111 and that was interesting just just into the throttle here now you have these taller bars on <laughs> so you, you kind of feel like you kind of feel a little more of the in the wind experience. You know, oddly enough, even with the bars being taller, they don't feel bad. Come on, scooter guy. This is the this is actually a new Goldwing trike. I guess they took it and they triked it out. It's interesting. They will let you uh, demo those. So it's got a really nice lopey idle. guys getting it in hands are a little higher just gotta uh, actually got some space before I can get up there Scooter guy to the 116. What's up, bro? A lot of vibration in your feet, but I know that's pretty much that's all motor vibration. That's just the movement of the pistons.
have a nice uh, gear indicator. You guys probably already watched me ride the 111, so you know by now it's not much difference. Along with that, of the gauges and the things that you have there to choose from. to get some decent lean angle so let's take her out what'd you say hit it damn uh, yeah man whoo don't take long to get into not legal mode oh man but a cruise is really nice. You know, it's weird. I rode the other one and I felt like I was sitting kind of hunched or leaned forward or, you know, it was an odd feeling. But I ride this one and I don't really get that feeling. I don't know. Look, we got cruise control. Is it set? No. All right, here we go. All right, there we go. Set the cruise control. So you can set your... That's really nice. Nice to have cruise control. I have a throttle lock on mine, which works really nice. But, I mean, it's not the same. You can tap and... You know, the funny thing. Harley, they put it on this side, which I think is a little better because you can kind of... You know, you can just control it like that with this hand, with this, with this, with your thumb. You know, that makes it a lot easier. Maybe even a little bit more practical in my eyes anyway. But... I mean, this works just fine. You know, this works just fine. I mean, it, it does the job. Most times, a lot of people activate cruise control because they just want to take a break. You know what I mean? A lot of vibration in the bars, but you know what? Hop that motor, you're going to get that. You really can't complain about that. So, but it's just something that you do notice. You tap the brake and cruise control is off. Turn it off again. You don't need that hit to let's try tour mode in the corners gotta roll off throttle and we go to tour mode oh wow that's really dulled down that really dulls it down double tap and screens are already all the way up okay so we'll try this all the way down on the highway yeah, you do get a lot of wind noise, but I guess, you know, it's a motorcycle, you're going to get wind. You know, you can't block it all. I don't feel any excess heat on the left side or the right side, which is nice. Downshift's really nice. Um, it's a really nice feel overall. I'll go over here. Make this right. here we hit the cruise the uh, twisty section so when I took out the 111 I noticed in standard mode it was a little it felt a little twitchy you know I don't know but let's see how let's see how this mode feels that feels a lot more subdued I should say which is nice like that. That feels way more subdued. You could have waited a few minutes, a few seconds, you know, like a few seconds out of your life would have killed you there. Suspension feels good through here. Yeah, so I'm gonna, I figured I would take this chieftain out for a roll. And then I'm gonna go set my tent and whatnot up and come back and we'll do the eluder. I'm scheduled to do the eluder at uh, three o'clock. Yeah, so enjoy the ride.
lot of deer in this area here. got a really nice balanced feel to it even when it hits the dips it feels really nicely balanced funny these bars actually feel well I mean it's not really funny but you know these bars actually feel pretty good I mean they are high don't get me wrong they're probably like a 12 inch maybe somewhere around there but man they feel good dude they feel pretty darn good This is a nice little test ride through here. You really do get to have a feel for the bike. De decent feel for it. Ooh, what the heck? Oh, shoot. Oh, I bumped the button. Yeah, so anyway, you do get a nice little feel for the bike. Um, I tried to get the best feel that I could for it, you know, as best I can. And uh, hope you guys enjoyed the, the test ride. So it wasn't really a, a great test ride and, and I'm not taking any chances with it or whipping around corners <laughs> but uh you know it's a nice experience man I mean if you if you get the chance to get out and ride some bikes you know definitely definitely get out and take it for a spin you know take it for a rip man you get a local bike week and they do demos you know go out and and have a good time you know Take a bike out and have a good time. Enjoy the ride. So we're gonna take you back into the Mary-Kate town over here. Over here in Lake George, where we have a mary -Kate going on. Nice event, a lot of fun. Everybody's having a good time. I've, you know, I've never, come here and not had a good time you know definitely one of those things one of those places for me where I come here and you know so oh, I've always had fun man. and uh, this time I came out and met up with a buddy uh, motor rider motor rider uh, 41 he does vlogs also great guy man great guy to bump into bumped into another viewer I, I didn't even know the, I didn't even know the gentleman uh, you know uh, and um, man I tell you I, I, I he's like oh man hey he said, hey Tibesh what hey, what's up I'm like huh I was like who me who looking around I'm looking around like who who me <laughs> so anyway I got some pens and and um I got some some stickers and stuff man so I'm trying to hit him up and let him know like hey you know hey i don't you know i don't want to say his name he starts with a c i don't want to put his public name out there but you know he's, and um this I, you know give him give him a few man Just thank you for watching man I, I mean i really appreciate it dude i mean i was blown away i'm like somebody recognized me <laughs> you know like 
wow I, I don't know it, it just it just took me by surprise so I, I just wasn't expecting it you know so anyhow um so I'm about to turn the bike back in and you know what this has been actually a uh, this has been a joy to ride man the strata liner there you know this bike's been a joy to ride I mean holy crap you would think that maybe that I, I would not like it I mean you know I rode that victory that time and I didn't like the uh, I didn't like the bars but you know I'm taking took this one out and you know I do like it I like the bars they're nice wow you know the only thing the, the Indian um, the throttle could probably use a little refinement or maybe it's just you got to get used to it sometimes it's like that you know you gotta adjust to it what the heck you know you just gotta adjust oh it doesn't like it if you low low idle it alrighty 